guys welcome back to my corner so today i have a special guest with me this is my daughter trinity and we're doing something really fun we're going to be unboxing a snack box and this is by munch pack one thing that me and my daughter have in common aside from doing spas together is that we love to eat like we love to try different types of foods like she might be a little questionable at first but she'll try it for you at least once like my husband and my son are the same in that they stick to the food that they like and they don't want to try other foods. I love to try all sorts of foods all around the world and I enjoy that. I guess you can call me and my daughter more of a foodie kind of person. Actually, I first saw Munch Pack by one of my friends here on YouTube, which is Blanca. She has a YouTube channel, Miss Queen B, and I'll link her channel up here or in the description below. She had a $5 discount code, and I was like, yes, I need to try it right away. This box <laughs> contains a lot of snacks, and it snacks all around the world. And that's what makes it different because you get to try all these different things foods that you don't normally get here in the United States. This box is $13.99 and you get up to five, five to six uh, snack items from all over the world. There's also a family pack. And so if I like the snacks here, I'm thinking of getting or at least trying the family pack. In case you're interested, I do have a $5 discount code as well. I'll put the referral link down in the description below so you guys can, you know, try this at least because with my $5 discount, I got this for around $8.99. I believe it's free shipping. I'll let you guys know right here if it is free shipping. You ready? Not yet. Make a big puzzle and comment down below what's your favorite snack. Yes. That's right. Good thing she reminded me. Oh my god. This is what it looks like right here. Such a pretty box. It says munch pack all around. It came in the mail, well packaged. It was covered in plastic and then I had to rip the plastic open. And so now we have this nice cute little box right here. A little booklet that talks about all of the snacks that you have as well as the other snacks that are available in their original pack and family pack. They even have like a soda upgrade. So you can see there's a soda upgrade right there in case you wanna add that to your box. Maybe every month there's a certain type of country that's featured, I don't know. Here are my snacks, our snacks. Oh, you just burned. <laughs> we just had breakfast. It's like nice and early in the morning. I have to tell you guys a story. I injured my hand. It's hard to twist this way. And so when I wash my face, it hurts. When I put on makeup today, it hurts. After I injured my hand the next day, I had like the stomach flu. Really, really bad stomach ache. The kind that you can't put any food in. And then this box arrived and I was like, Oh my gosh, I so wanted to film and try the food already. I have been sitting on this box for four days, guys. I wanted to film this with my daughter so bad and she's been waiting patiently. Which one do you want to try first? Pick one. Ooh, okay. Can you show them up close? There you go. So let me read this. What is this? It's a frit smoothie, strawberry, raspberry, apple, and currant, or coconut and passion fruit. New flavors blended together in a sweet smoothie style chew. So it's kind of like a chewy snack. These flavors come together with a balanced treat with tart, sweet, and exotic notes in every bite and this snack is from germany so if you guys are from germany comment down below if you've had this snack do you like this type of snack oh there's a lot of them here in one package that's so good it smells good. why don't we just share oh yeah it does smell good you know what you know what this reminds me of? Like Fruit Loops. Like we don't eat Fruit Loops here in this house. I don't think my daughter 
or my son has ever tried it. I've tried it personally. It's not my favorite snack. So we got like a total of one, two, three, four, and five. Five snacks. Oh no, six. Wow, that's a lot. And it's supposed to be chewy. So and tasty. And tasty. Let's see if it's chewy and tasty. Yeah, it's starting to look like those Fruit Loops. Is oh, it Fruit it Loops? Like I'll put the name of the snack that I'm talking about right here. So it smells so good. Okay, so you rip it open like that. Okay. Yeah, it's chewy. What do you think? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. It's this just, is good. Yeah. It's just like strawberry or a cherry. It's just like a like, type of fruit. Uh-huh, that's right. It's like strawberries or cherry. It's really chewy, but it's not like the kind that sticks to your teeth. Well, it kind of does, but it's not that harsh on the teeth, which I like. So it's pretty soft. It's sweet and tart at the same time, but not too tart. So I know this is the kind of snack that my daughter would like. It looks like a bubble gum. Oh yeah, it does kind of look like a bubble gum, huh? You're gonna finish that? I still wanna finish it, but for the sake of this video. Mm. Mm. Yum. I don't wanna eat too much because my stomach is just learning how to <laughs> taking food again <laughs> you look so comfortable there with your leg up mommy is pregnant you... i'm not pregnant i'm not pregnant guys i just look like i'm pregnant <laughs> i would say this um snack from germany is a thumbs up for me too terry's corner approved which one do you want to try next mm. and then you put that one. Oh my okay. god i'm kind of scared so... of this one I know Blanca from Miss Queen Bee actually tried this. She didn't like it. So we'll see. This one is a snack from Japan. And it's a premium umaibo, umaibo, mozzarella, and camembert. I know those are types of cheeses. So I like mozzarella. I don't think I've tasted camembert. I just know it's a type of cheese. So it's a savory and crunchy corn stick is packed with delicious cheesy flavors like mozzarella and camembert. That's a perfect anytime treat. This is a snack from Japan, guys. From Japan. Oh, I love Japan. I love Japan snacks. You know what? When my husband was sent to Japan for work, he asked me, what do you want me to bring back from Japan? And he was there for like seven days. I told him the only thing I want back are snacks. I had like a matcha tea matcha green tea kit kat um like all sorts of food items and snacks that are popular in japan i told him to bring it but i don't think we've tried this even soda i try it. i can't even read it because it looks like it's um in japanese uh, it looks like there's only one in this package so we have to share it looks like a brain like brain. cheetos or something you want to try it first or me how about you try it it tastes like Cheetos! <laughs> it's like cheese puffs. Do you like it? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Oh, you like it? Here. Don't lie if you don't like it. I like it. I can eat this. I mean, it's like one giant cheese puff, you know? It's super crunchy. Hmm. Mm. I like it. Thumbs up for this because I love Cheetos. I love cheese puffs. We don't have them all the time here at home, but I like it. My kids, my kids are just not snack people. They love fresh fruits. Trinity, which one are you gonna pick next? Come on, where is the chocolate? Where is my? Oh, here it is. Okay, which one is this? It's Oh, this one is from Italy. Okay. Okay, dolce, dolcetto, dolcetto, mm. dolcetto. Maybe it's dolcetto. Dolcetto cookies and cream wafer bites with expertly Lucky. crisp and creamy wafer yeah. cookies and premium ingredients mm. to create an indulgent and sweet tooth satisfying snack. 
Looks like this. That's interesting. You get one. And it looks like an Oreo. Yeah, it does smell like Oreo. Yo, I bet the cream is inside. Mmm. Says right there. It's more crispier than Oreo, so like the brown or black um, layer is a lot thinner and crispier. Really good. Thumbs up for me. What about you, Trini? Good. How many stars? Out of five stars, how many stars? Five, six. <laughs> Trinity, which one do you want to pick? Which one? Come on, um, something else or something? Nutella. Nutella. <laughs> we love Nutella in this house. Yeah. We always get a big jar of Nutella from Costco. Actually, I made some cupcakes the other day against my will. Do you know how it feels like to make cupcakes be and ready. not be able to eat it because your stomach aches? <laughs> my daughter wanted me to make chocolate cupcakes and then I made the icing with nutella it was really good like she loves it it's a nutella be ready these crisp and crunchy wafers filled with nutella cream are the perfect way to get your nutella fix on the go so you better be ready for this taste experience and this is from poland nutella is from poland i thought it was from the united states i don't know Guys, tell me all about Nutella. <laughs> I'm right. I suck at that, like where things come from. Let's try this. It's it's like double package. That's interesting. Yeah. So I ripped this one off. It's kind of a waste of packaging to me. And then you get this. And you get two, which is good. So we'll save this for brother because I know he loves Nutella. And it looks like this. It's shaped pretty odd. Yum, yum, yum. Like I had to cough out a piece of the cracker. It just went down the wrong pipe, you know? Okay, and she started eating it already. She couldn't wait, okay. Yeah, but I'm still super hungry. Mmm. The outer shell is like a wafer snack. <laughs> but it's not sweet at all. It's very bland, actually. I got chocolate. Mmm. Go get some wipes. Really good. You have that sweet Nutella with the really plain wafer. You think we can give this to brother for snack? Yeah. My daughter keeps looking over there because we have my phone airplayed to our big screen TV. She's seeing herself and looking at herself. The last one. Okay, hold it up for them. Okay, the last one is a Torres Black Truffle Chips. Crunchy, rich, salty, and sweet. And savory chips nice. are like nothing you've had. Oh yeah, she said are like Lay's. And this is from Spain, guys. It has a perfect truffle aftertaste. Um, you know what restaurants like they'll say something with truffles and I really don't know how truffles taste like on its own. So I don't know what to expect. Let's see. It looks like lace potato chips. Okay. It's full on. I got a whiff of like potato chips. <laughs> And then it, it, it smelled funny. <laughs> She's like eating it with her nose pinched. Mm. I guess this is what truffles taste like. Mm. You like it? Mm. No. I've tasted truffles before. Now that I'm tasting this, it's bringing me back. I mean, I don't mind it, but I don't think kids will like it. It's not like straight up Lay's potato mm -hmm. chips. Trinity, thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Mm. To me, it is more like this. I'm not sure. I could go either way. It's not my favorite. It just, that truffle taste kind of throws me off. 
I guess I'm just kind of looking for like a plain old Lay's potato chips, but then it wouldn't be from Spain, right? Yeah, there's that earthy, kind of like mushroomy taste at the beginning or at the end, and then you get the saltiness of the potato chips. It's all right. So that is everything in our box. Mommy, what's your favorite? My favorite? It would have to be a tie between the cookies and cream and the Nutella. I also like this, guys, the one from Japan. I mean, it just brings back the kid in me. What about you, Trinity? What, what's your favorite? This. I oh. love it. I love it. My favorite Which one? Show it to them. What, what is it? Bubblegum. The bubble gum. It's the um, it's the fruit smoothie mm. snack from Germany. That is it, guys, for this Munch Pack unboxing. I hope mm. you enjoyed it with my girl Trinity. Happy monkey and brown monkey. Oh, okay, pink monkey and brown monkey. They always have to be with us. <laughs> if you want to watch other Munch Pack unboxings, I know I have a few more friends that are on their way to trying out this box. If they have a video on it, I'll link them down below in the description box. Mm. But yeah, I wanna say thank you to Blanca from Mrs. Queen B for introducing mm. me to the Munch Pack snack box. And yeah, I think we're gonna do this maybe once every other month just to, you know, just to have fun with my daughter. So in case you are wondering what we're wearing, just a few products that I wanna highlight. I use the Iconic London Illuminator again for my highlighter on my nose. It looks like it's popping on camera, but I don't know until I do the editing. Love this. For my lips today is by Fenty Beauty. <clears throat> in the color i'll put the color in the description down below because i can't see it but that's what i have on my lips right now and then i finally got to try the morphe setting spray but this one has a twist this is the one where they collabed with jeffree star this is the most unique spray guys like it's so um the spray is like, it's more like a mist. Like it's not very um, harsh when it sprays on you. It has a scent to it, but I think the one that's just regular in the black packaging doesn't have any scent. That's it. And Trinity has something on too. What do you have? A mermaid. A mermaid. <laughs> this guys is from Tarte and this is in the color Ocean Girl. And these are beach cheeks. It's a cream blush, but it doubles as a lipstick too. Yep. So it's very subtle on her, which is what I like. I selected this specifically because Tarte is um, all natural mm. cruelty free brand well at least this product right here that so. is it guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already comment down below what you think would be your favorite snack and as always i hope to see you guys back in my corner soon bye bye and don't forget to click subscribe button and yep. a bell button. Yes, don't forget. I always forget to say that. But yes, please subscribe. Join the family. There's always something to learn here on my channel. Bye, guys.